wonderful viewers, Ed Varitis is back again, you know, today we are doing something exceptional, very, very exceptional. You know, there is this... Is it about reaction? No, this is not a reaction. Oh, okay. this, this is a discussion. All right. Yeah, you know, there's something that's been bothering us, we need to discuss it today. <laughs> you know, lots of people do try this habit, it's very bad. We don't know it's bad, though. that's why we're here to discuss. You know, now you have already said it's bad. It's a slip of tongue. Oh, okay. I don't know how bad it is, unless our viewers <laughs> comment, you know, they have to bring the ideas, we want to share them. So, yeah. so it's all about mm -hmm. drinking water while eating. Yes. You yes. do that a lot. Why have you been doing that? I, I, do, I do that when I'm, the food chokes me. So. <laughs> when I'm being choked by the food. So, so the question is, <laughs> drinking water while eating, Yeah. is it healthy? Should we avoid it? Because sometimes, most videos that I see, when people are doing this bag or eating, even their normal routine, yeah. you see that they eat a little, then they will drink maybe Sprite, Coke mm -hmm. or something. Yes. They want to good? push down the food. <laughs> they, they want, want their food to go fast. Yeah, they want to push it down. <laughs> but is it really true that that will push the food down? What do you think? Talk it to me. What I think is, um, I don't think it's a good eating habit. You know, it, it, when we talk of eating habit, I don't think it's good. I mean, what I was taught is at least you eat after a few minutes, then you take in maybe a glass or two of water. Fine, okay. But, I've, I've done a research here and it shows that okay. when you drink water during your meals, mm -hmm. yeah, your sal uh, saliva gets diluted. Okay. And then when it's diluted, this only sends weaker signals to the stomach. Ah. So, sipping a little water during meals isn't a cause for concern. But drinking a whole glass or two is going to interfere with our digestive system. So those who take sip, sip, small, small, it doesn't matter. Hey, that's not a concern. Yes, so concerning what you just said, this uh, macrobiotic counselor, Dr. Shonali Sabewa of uh, India, mm. yeah, she, he also disagrees on that, that it's not a good habit when we eat and take in water at the same time. So it's a normal habit for the Indians. You see, I learned they normally do that a lot. Anytime they're eating, they like taking in a lot of water. So that doctor, who's a counselor, a macrobiotic counselor, came out that, you know, there's this uh, uh, digestive juices that breaks down the food. When we eat them, so mm. when you're taking water before, yeah, before eating, uh, taking water at the same time eating, it's like you are pushing down the digestive juices that will break down the food for easy uh, mm. digestion. So I don't think it's it's a good habit. You know, oh, we, 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 okay. we need to stop that. But, but when you are being choked, you can sip yeah, a little. Yes, yeah, yeah, sometimes yes, so. like when you are taking. This Nigeria para that we took in Nigeria. See how it choked me. You took water before the food was put down. Mommy, you are confusing me here. <laughs> you are confusing so, me. So it's best to drink fluids okay. before eating or two hours after meals because this is going to help in the absorption of the nutrients. Yeah. So this is my practice, what I've been practicing. You don't see me eating and then drinking water intermittently or something. So I mean, instead of water, we can just like take, be taking in some juice, sipping juice. It's a little right, maybe orange juice, pineapple juice, and uh, just to make yeah, some look at it. <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So I'll viewers, tell us in the comment section what you think about this thing. Is it good that we, we whilst eating, we will still be drinking water? Because I see this a lot on the whitish page. I see it a lot in homes. We are talking about healthy lifestyles. Our children are also uh, uh, copying us. And so that tradition of eating and drinking is going on. But according to the research you said, I think it's something that we have to sit down and then examine it, whether it will benefit our health, healthy lifestyle. So viewers, let's know your your views on it mm. in the comment section yeah, we so we thank you all our returning subscribers kudos to you we also want to appreciate you for taking us to 2k subscribers it's not easy yeah. 
Yeah. Your journey guys. wasn't easy. It hasn't yeah. been easy. It has not been uh, easy, it has been, but we are still... It has been full of rain, <laughs> sunshine, <laughs> dust, but and you are with us throughout, so we say kudos and thank yeah, you so thank much. Thank you. And, and then we are also inviting our new ones. If you are watching us and you have not subscribed, please do like, share our videos and subscribe. And we thank you. Keep living a healthy life because this is going to keep you from doctors for a long while. Yeah. Yeah. So that's the other photo. It's English. English is so easy. We are no, we are not English people. We have learned it. So not Basel, Basel. Okay, viewers. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye.